Gretel, a guest is coming to eat tonight. Prepare two delicious fowls. As you wish, master. Gretel killed two fowls, plucked them, and put them on the spit. Soon they started to brown. Master, if the guest doesn't come, then I shall have to take the chickens off of the spit. It would be rather shameful if they aren't eaten at the right time. I will fetch him. While her master was away, Gretel kept cooking the chickens. Soon she got quite thirsty from standing near the fire. She ran to the cellar to get some wine. After her first drink, she took another. After her second drink, Gretel felt hungry. She thought the chickens should be tasted, so she put a finger on each and tasted them. She thought they were delicious. Oh no! One of the wings is burning! I must cut it off and eat it. When she ate it, she realized something. If the other wing isn't gone, Master will know something is absent. When she took another drink, the second wing was gone. Her Master wasn't back yet. Since one chicken has already been partially eaten, I might as well take another drink and eat it all. Gretel took another drink and ate the rest of the chicken. She looked out the window and her master still wasn't back. Maybe they aren't coming back at all. I might as well eat the second chicken. She took yet another drink and ate the second chicken. Just then, her master came back. Serve the fowl soon, Gretel. The guest is running after me. As you wish, Master. Soon I shall serve the chickens. Gretel's master took his knife, which he would use to carve the chickens, and sharpened it. Suddenly, Gretel heard a knock at the door. When she answered it, she saw the guest. Shh! Run as quickly as you can. Although Master did invite you to dinner, he really wants to chop your ears off. When the guest heard this, he immediately ran away. Gretel ran to her master. You invited quite a guest, Master. What do you mean, Gretel? He has taken the two chickens I made for dinner. What a trick! As soon as this was heard, Gretel's master ran after the guest. Just one! The guest thought her master wanted to cut off one of his ears, so he ran like his skin was on fire. <laughs>